Dear Paul Stewart, two years ago I came to the school because it was a fun and new idea, and it was the place I felt at home. Twig made me want to be adventurous and help me go to the school and find a safer school that is life learning place, and I seem like I wanted to go to, besides Cord Bennett School. Me and Twig's adventures are almost similar in a way, that they are all adventures and help us discover our life. Me and Twig have both gotten to a place with a way bigger person who has turned out to be way more nice than you think. And Twig met a band bear that was nicer than he thought and showed him that there are berries to eat. Or the time Twig was swallowed by a plant teacher, and while that happened, his coat saved them from being crushed by a scratched by plant teeth. Because the coat was made of animal fur that acts like a knife when it brushes the wrong way. This is like the time when I got a new fishing license and went out fishing and had it on me when a cop on a jeep came over. I was scared so bad that I started acting like I did a crime and said I was innocent. But he just asked if I had a license and I showed up to him and he said good luck and went away. Twig taught me to be always prepared in a way. I thought me and Twig's enemies are the same too in appearance and for instance the ugly crow that put him in a cocoon seems like he has the same voice as an annoying kid at the other school was Black's hair in a screechy voice. Your book makes me have a connection with Twig and his enemies, but in my main connection with Twig is that we both are down when we don't have anyone around us or someone to be. And we both make friends along journeys. Even though we both live in totally different worlds, we have totally different species as friends, but my dog, but we both have similarities.